So the next one on the list is a very helpful feature that's an auxiliary player called Media Hub. What it does is, uh, well, it is a player that um, it plays video, it plays the audio, and it also do a couple different things that we're gonna learn right away. The first thing that we can check, or that we can see right now, is that we're gonna find some files. It could be uh, videos, as a, let's say regular videos. Let's put this one. It could be uh, pictures. As you can see, something like this one. It could also be a live feed from a, a camera, an IP camera. Let's say, I don't know, this one that says Bourbon Street, New Orleans, Louisiana. So that's, that's the extension of this uh, Media Hub. You got different buttons. You got the play button right here. You got the pause. You got the stop button. Also, you got a loop. You got a mute button right here. Um, it plays audio and video. So that's why this button right here, the mute button. Or if you want something like a picture that stays always on screen, it's going to last like 9 seconds. But with the loop button right here, it'll be till you say, no, I don't want you anymore. So it'll hold still. For us to uh, make the configs, let's say to, to make the feed, the video, audio, or any other kind of feed, we just got to hit the preset manager right here. One of the things we got to do is hit new and name our um, name our source the way that we want. So let's say is test 01 and after that we just click those three that button and we find our content let's say we wanna use this one that says uh, Corona and okay if we wanna mute the audio like, uh, like automatically or if we want to, to loop the media file it's a PNG so it will be helpful let's hit OK we go to the bottom part and we'll find our test 01 and this this one right here so as you can see it's muted and it's looped so if we click the loop button we just stop the loop and then we hit play if we want to watch it again the other different things that we can find right here is uh, something like this let's say this file or this yeah, this file called Videos Locales, we got this title. And after that, we find a URL. This URL is, um, well, eDrive, Autocom, Audio, Top English. And uh, inside of this bracket, you got a, you got a command. That's R-N-D. What this does is uh, it plays all the files that are inside of that um, folder, this top and glass folder, in a random mode. So we'll be able to play, let's say, anything that we got there in a random mode. So as soon as it's finished, it'll go to another video, another random video, and uh, it's gonna keep on going. The other thing, other things that we can do is that we can also um, use uh, URLs from uh, different IP cameras. Let's say this one from Copacabana Beach is this uh, URL right here. Also, we got this one that's on Lincoln Road from this right here. We got Sunny Isles. And every single one of those are files or, um, well, more than files are live feeds from a URL um, that's getting an IP camera. So if we hit OK right here and we go and check it, 
we can see, let's say, uh, for Lauderdale Fishing Pier, it's going to say buffering until we got uh, an image. This is the lab feed from for Lauderdale, the fishing pier. We also have, let's say, Times Square. And then it stops the last one. And this one is live, is also live. Bourbon Street. All that can be done through the Media Hub.